Boris Becker has got himself suited and booted at the Berlin International Film Festival alongside his partner Lillian de Carvalho. The former tennis star, 55, has recently headed back to his native Germany after serving eight months of a two-year prison sentence and in London after being found guilty of hiding 2.5 million pounds of assets and loans to avoid paying debt. But after starting a new life after being released from prison and being deported from the UK, Boris has begun enjoying life in the spotlight once again and he and Lillian stepped out for a night at a premiere. He was the star of the show as the documentary by Alex Gibney titled Boom, Boom, The World Versus. Boris Becker focuses on his rise to sporting stardom. Boris looked dapper in his red carpet ensemble, opting for a crisp white shirt, black waistcoat, black tie and black blazer. His trousers matched and he slipped into a pair of shiny smart black dress shoes for the special evening. Boris' gorgeous girlfriend chose to match her loved one with her black strapless floor-length gown. She wore a pair of black pointed toe court heels which kept her look chic and classy. Her beautiful raven tresses were styled poker straight and she tucked the face framing pieces behind her ears. Lillian had a glamorous face of makeup with a shimmering gold eyeshadow look and a matte nude lip. Her earrings were the only accessory of choice, leaving her glowing décolletage bare. Becker's girlfriend Lillian is a political risk analyst who started dating the three-time Wimbledon champion in the summer of 2020 after he split with his ex-wife Lily in 2018 following nine years of marriage. In December, three-time Wimbledon champion Boris was freed from jail after serving just eight months of his two-and-a-half-year sentence and was deported from the UK. The tennis star, who won the All England Club tournament at the age of just 17, was convicted in April of hiding £2.5 million worth of assets and loans to avoid paying his debt. He is thought to have returned to his hometown of Lehman, where his 87-year-old mother Elvira left, for an emotional reunion with his loved one. Boris' mother reportedly told a friend, This is the best Christmas present I could hope for. I cannot wait to hold my beloved son in my arms. Last week, Boris thanked world number one Novak Djokovic for backing him during his time spent in prison, claiming he cried in his cell when the Serb won Wimbledon last summer, presenting a new documentary about his on-court triumph and off-court travails at the Berlin Film Festival. The 55-year-old said his former pupil had been a steadfast ally. Novak Djokovic became a family member. You know we had a professional relationship for many years and we parted ways in 2016, Becker told a news conference. But we always stayed close and especially my time inside while I was inside. Novak supported me, he supported my family. I started crying when he started winning. From 2014 to 2016, Becker coached Djokovic to six of his 22 Grand Slams. The Serbian said he was heartbroken when his former coach was sentenced to prison.